going down, Commanders? I just want to give you a little bit of an update. Uh, this accidental, by mistake, whoops, we slipped. Our fingers hit the button and we, it wasn't meant to come out till next week. Bullshit. This addition to the fucking rocket silo, uh, defensive rocket silo, and the heavy turrets, it's a smokescreen. It's the paper over the cracks. It's to show that the they, they kicks are making... Basically, what they're doing is they're taking the, the voice off the real problem in the game. And sh shining a, a, a carrot in front of our face. That's all it is. This is fucking 101 manipulation at its finest. This doesn't impress me. It doesn't interest me. Yes, of course I'm going to fucking start upgrading them. But... They should have done it at the appropriate time, when it was supposed to come out, not when someone did a live stream slagging off cheaters and everything else. Kicks eye are showing time and time and time again that they have got no clue. They think we're stupid as people. That's the God's honest truth. They think we are fucking stupid. And that's the, that's the whole reason I exist. It's to show that we're not that fucking dumb. What you think, giving us a new rocket in the rocket silo, two new rockets in the rocket silo, and a, a new heavy turret is going to make us forget about the big issue in the game, the big problem. It's not going to fucking stop that. I don't give a fuck if it does stop the cheats. I really couldn't care less. If there's a fucking rampant cheat problem in the game, I'm going to keep calling you out. And I'm going to call you out every single fucking day. Every single live stream, every single video, I'm going to make notes. Because this is manipulation, this is disgusting. You want me to go, yay, a new rocket. You give us one fucking Thorium upgrade on a fucking level 10 rocket. Is it a level 10 rocket? Level 5 rocket? And you want me to cheer and say, you've done a good 10. 10 levels on it, one Thorium. One, one of them fucking levels is Thorium. And they want us to cheer and say, sing, oh, kicks are the greatest. No, you're not. You're a bunch of fucking wankers manipulating fucking scumbags. And that's the fucking truth. Once again, you've proven to be not worthy of fucking producing or making or being anywhere associated with anything to do with fucking computer games. Because you are manipulative fucking pricks. Your mum and dad must be real proud of you. I couldn't give a fuck if you drive a BM or a Lada. I judge people by what the fucking actions they do in real life. And your actions, anyone that's working at Kickside right now, your actions is disgustful, disgusting, deplorable. It's, it's the actions of a fucking a leech. Leeching onto the players, knowing that that some of these well coiners are going to go out and spend every fucking everything on the, these units. Some people that can't afford it are going to do the same thing. Well, I'm not. I'm not stupid. I'm not dumb. You're worthless. You can't even fucking take care of the fucking big issue. You want to throw bells and whistles at us? Not going to work with me. <laughs> not going to work with me. Fuck you. Everyone's talking about these now. I'm not. I'm talking about the cheat problem. The massive cheat problem. This isn't a little cheat problem. This is fucking a third of the player base. Maybe you're in cahoots with them. And that's what's making me think more and more. Every time I fucking bring this up on a video, a live stream, every t single time I say something about it, it makes me, it convinces me that there's employees. Or an employee involved with this. There's plural, or there's there's one. So we at Kickside, you're not going to win me over with bells and whistles and a stupid fucking missile in rocket silo that that's dead in one shot. Doesn't wash with me. Anyway, guys, take care. Peace out. See you soon.